Hey everyone, so I'm on XBiz's website, and let me read you here what it says. Uh, the adult star August Amos has passed away, the Ventura County Medical Examiner confirmed. The cause of death has not been disclosed, but Amos was 23. Um, but clearly, from what we saw on Twitter of saying, fuck y'all, and from all of her friends that are posting on Twitter... It appears to be suicide, but we can't disclose anything because we have no evidence of it whatsoever. But it appears to be suicide related. Um, husband director Kevin Moore issued a statement in regards to her death. She was the kindest person I ever knew, and she meant the world to me. Please leave this as a private family matter in this difficult time. Born August 23rd in Nova Scotia, Canada, Amos Barton, another Canadian, Amos bartended before joining the adult and performing in her first solo fetish shoot in 2013. Since then, Amos racked up more than 100 IMDb credits shooting for prestigious studios such as Evil Angel, Wicked Pictures, Pure Play Media, Twisties, Naughty America, and more. The industry took to Twitter to express their condolences. Director and Gamma Films head of production, Bree Mills, tweeted, What a sad day. Let us remember social media can and should be a great place for discourse. But it can also have a tremendous impact. There have been too much negativity in the past few months with in fighting and subtweets. Let's cool it and support one another. Rest in peace. Amos had shoot shot over twenty scenes for girlsway.com, which Mills overlooks. Jules Jordan, director and producer over at Jules Jordan Video, said, Rest in peace, August Amos, one of the best, nicest I have ever knew in the business. Billy Visual, director and cinematographer, shared a picture of Amos' first scene with Brazzers. I had the pleasure of shooting her first scene with Brazzers and Karen Lee. We knew that she was a going she was going to kill it. So sad that she left us too soon. Rip August Amos. Uh, Brazzers has also stated, like everyone else, we're just hearing about August Amos, and we're devastated. Our hearts and thoughts and prayers go to the family and friends. Heartbreaking news, rest in peace. Um, fellow stars such as Abella Danger has said, I don't like a lot of girls, and I can honestly say I loved her so much. She was more ge the most genuinely kind-hearted girl I had the pleasure of becoming friends with. I love you forever. Uh, Rachel Rain said, I, oh my God, I'm absolutely sick to my stomach. I can't believe what I'm hearing. Rest in peace, August Amos. You're such a beautiful woman. My heart is crushed. Jason Brown writes, one of the last times we got to hang out with Abella Danger at Jules Jordan. Such a happy time. I'm going to miss you, girl. You were so cool at this place. Oh, what? Anyway, rest in peace. And there was a picture of her and looks like Abella Danger and a giant ducky on a pool. Um, Kendra Luss writes, may you rest in peace, beautiful. Um, so we will put this link in the description. Um, apparently, it looks like it was from harassment that drove her to suicide. Um, but we don't have the details. But we will put a link in the description. And um, August Amos passes away at 23 years old. Another Canadian. First, we learned that Sheila Stiles, which we still don't know the details um, of exactly how she died. All we know is that Sheila Stiles died in, in her bed sleeping and her mother found her unresponsive. But nobody knows if it was medication. Nobody knows if it was an accidental Overdose, nobody knows if it was drugs, nobody really knows what happened to Sheila Stiles. Um, but now we're learning that there's a possibility of suicide of August Amos, who leaves us at the age of 23. And uh, this is really heartbreaking news. Another Canadian gone way too soon. So, like we said in the previous video, um, when we find more information, we will let you know.